David Lightman was a master at computer games. A fast thinker. Oh, David! <laughs> Maybe you could tell us who first suggested the idea of reproduction without sex. Your wife? <laughs> Get out, Lightman. And a promising student Hi. at an old game. Hi. With an electronic twist. Are those your grades? Yeah. I don't think that I deserved an F. Do you? You can go to jail for that. Only if you're over 18. This computer company is coming out with these amazing new games in a couple of months. And I want to play those games. Wow. What? We got something. He found the right code word to play the game. We're in. But it was the wrong computer. Shall we play a game? How can I ask you that? How about global thermal nuclear war? Fine. All right. <laughs> Their trajectory headings for multiple impact re-entry vehicles. What does that mean? I don't know, but it's great. <laughs> All stations, this is Crystal Palace. I wonder if I should use my subs. 22 Typhoon-class submarines departing Petropavlov. What in the hell's happening here? Oh, my God. Shall we play? I have seven. Correction, eight. That's eight Redbirds. Get on the sack. Tell them to flush the bombers. The Russians are still denying everything, sir. Who are you working with? Nobody. I do not believe you. Over day, we have Soviet missile warning. Based on your arrest, pending indictment for espionage. Espionage? Confidence is high. I repeat, confidence is high. Cobra Dane, is this an exercise? Negative, this is not an exercise. Give me the president on the horn. It's still playing the game. Sir, it's going to start a war. Close up the mouth. Is this a game, or is it real? War Games, playing soon at a theater near you. Shall we play? The government says no classified information was released. The computer raiders say they were inspired by the movie War Games. Now, does all this mean we have a major security problem on our hands? Well, an expert talks about computer raids, and that's next. We're in. It thinks I'm Falcon. Shall we play a game? Let's play Global Thermonuclear War. Fine. <laughs> All right. Sure, it may make for great movies, but as we told you earlier, fact came a little too close to fiction in Milwaukee recently. Some whiz kids actually managed to dial their way into a computer at a nuclear weapons lab in Los Alamos, New Mexico. The lab says no classified information was compromised. But the question remains, could it really happen? 